Enhancements to aspects of our bodies, including our brains, stronger, smarter, or faster human beings, more fertile human beings, disease-resistant human beings, even if we did this radically to the extent to extents not even currently imaginable, we would not be changing our nature. Non-biological intelligence is multiplying by a thousand every decade, and even that speed is speeding up. But if you go out to the 2040s, the non-biological portion of the intelligence of our civilization will be about a billion times greater than the biological portion. But it won't be an alien invasion of intelligent machines to compete with us. I mean, it really is amplifying our own civilization, and we're going to literally enhance our own intellectual capabilities by ultimately merging with this technology. If uh, someone gets old or maybe uh, any disadvantage about the, their physical body, uh, uh, they can just switch their body to uh, work as normal. Or maybe uh, the, the worker can uh, use this uh, avatar robot to operate uh, uh, in work in the dangerous place from the safer place. I'm trying to, to move my, my hand, my fingers, um, in, just in my mind, so I have to be very concentrated. Um, and as um, the connection between my fingers and my, my, my brain is, is not, not there anymore, I still try to, 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 to move my fingers in my, just in my head. Technologies enable us to solve problems and overcome suffering. And basically, I, I see that as the grand goal, purpose of, of human civilization, to go beyond our limitations and fundamentally to expand human knowledge. <laughs>